Hey everyone, today we're going to be looking at the top 10 greatest moments in the show Amphibia. If you looked at the 11th greatest and 12th greatest moments in the show, they will not make this list. So let's just get started. Also spoilers. Number 10 the entirety of Cracking Mrs. Croker. While they consider it to be one of the greatest pieces of cartoon ever for the screen, full of heart, wit, and plot consistency, this episode is well by so many people who I think exist. Number 9. This shot from Snow Day where Wally and Felicia are 6 feet apart. It's only so low because of this stupid cock blocker. Number 8. This shot from Hot Popular where Wally and Felicia are 3 feet apart. Number 7. This shot from Fight or Fight where Wally and Felicia are a foot apart. The sexual tension in their faces alone is something to behold. Number 6. The scene in Thai Feud where Anne and Sprague travel back in time and run over the original Paul McCartney. Some say this foreshadows Anne's death at the end because Paul also died. I think they're right. Number 5. This shot where Wally looks directly at Felicia. Number 4. This shot from Turning Point where Wally and Felicia are half a foot apart. Sadly, there are no scenes where Wally and Felicia are no feet apart, which means I have to knock Amphibia's rating of a perfect 10 down to a 4. Number 3. The shot where Felicia looks directly at Wally. Number 2. Qui-Gon Jinn's death scene. I will admit it was very risky to kill off this character 8 seconds after his introduction, but it was worth it for such a memorable scene. And the number one greatest amphibious scene of all time is this. Wally! All the build-up throughout the series for this wondrous moment. It should be studied in film schools. The god of Kino himself, Daniel Espinosa, wept at this scene. And Martin Scorsese burned his collection of movie cameras because he could never make a movie to match this scene. It's why I wake up in the morning, it's why I eat, why I move, why I fuck. 